Hi everyone and welcome to the Abbey in Devon. I've just driven across here this morning. I'm going to spend most of the day out here. I'm going to be a guest in the house for a day visiting a friend. So I thought it'd be lovely to show you around the inside of the house. I've shown you outside many times I think as I've walked past it from the coast path. But I just wanted to show you inside today and give you a little bit of history as well. So let's make our way down to reception. It's just down here. As many of you will know, I used to live and work at the Abbey for six years. And I left here, I lose track now. I left here probably about 16, 17 years ago, but it's all looking very familiar. And I have been back once or twice since. It's an absolutely gorgeous place to live and work. So let's go and check in. Lee Abbey is home to a Christian community from over 20 different nationalities and they hold conferences and retreats here. I arrived during one of the sessions and I didn't like to interrupt so I went for a wander along the corridors and I went to see the chapel and the library. So here we are in the library. I don't know why I'm whispering, there's nobody else in here. But anyway, this is the library. I used to love coming up here and reading books and writing letters. It was back in the days when emails were not so popular, so I wrote lots of letters up here. And look at the view from out this window. It's absolutely gorgeous. Looking down onto the estate and down to Lee Bay Beach where I've done videos from in the past. Let me just show you a clearer view from the window. Look at that, it's just beautiful. So yeah, it just feels so lovely and familiar in here. A lot of the decoration around the corridors and everything has changed but it's looking absolutely amazing. But this place just feels the same. Really, really special place to be in. just in time for coffee and biscuits so yeah just got that each day there's a program of activities organized for the guests and I went to the second session and I really enjoyed the teaching there well it's a Wednesday today which means it's community day and that means the community are off doing things like having a communion service in the chapel and they have lots of activities going on for the community so there's less in the way of catering on a Wednesday lunchtime. There will be food tonight though but they've provided us with a lovely packed lunch which I just got and I'm going to go and meet my friend inside and have that and then this afternoon I'm going to bring us back out here and go for a walk. There's lots of cosy nooks and crannies inside where you can curl up with a book, chat to friends, new and old, and eat your packed lunch, of course. Oh, it was really nice to have a long sit down and a good catch up with my friend who I've not seen for ages. Had a really relaxing time and then we went for a walk. And just while we're outside, let me just tell you a little bit more about Lee Abbey. So Lee Abbey was founded in 1946 as a Christian community and it's a Grade 2 listed building. The current Gothic Revival buildings are from the 1850s. In the 1920s it was brought and ran as a hotel but that wasn't very successful. And during World War II it was used as a place where a boys school was evacuated to. After the war, the dilapidated buildings were bought for use as a Christian retreat, and that continues until today. 
Liabi is in Linton in North Devon. You pass through the Valley of Rocks to get there. And it's where Exmoor meets the sea. And there's 280 acres of estate to explore, with six miles of footpath. Liabi has its own cattle and sheep. And there's also a beach there, which I've shown in previous videos. And on that beach, you can find, perhaps, porpoises and seals. It's home to over a hundred different marine species. Lee Abbey welcomes people from all faiths and none to stay. You can take part in as much or as little as you want to of the organised programme. I'll take you back inside in a minute to have a look at some more of the house. There's lots more to show you. But let me tell you a little bit more about my time on community here while we walk to the viewpoint I'm going to show you. I was here from 2000 until 2006 and during that time I worked mostly in catering. I worked in the kitchen and also in the tea cottage in the summers and in the Beacon Youth Centre in the kitchen there. I'll show you the Beacon in a bit. I also planned and led weekends for guests and I made some wonderful lifelong friends here from all over the world and had loads of fun as well. I arrived as quite a shy person with, without much confidence really I'd say and I left here six years later quite a bit less shy and much more confident in myself and my abilities. So this is the view from Jenny's Leap. It's one of my favourite viewpoints at the Abbey. And just by this viewpoint, there's also a lovely shelter as well, with some fantastic views. After our walk, we went inside for Fawzies. Fawzies is served each day at four o'clock and it's tea, coffee, cake. And today was donuts and with a wonderful view. I had a little bit of time between Fawzies and the evening meal to film a little bit more of the house. So let me show you some more. So this is the Octag or the Octagonal Lounge where they hold lots of the talks and also some services as well. It's a lovely room and they also have entertainment here in the evenings which is always good fun. The Abbey also has a lovely little shop. I spent quite a lot of time in this shop and it has some lovely gifts and also if you forget anything like toothpaste and things like that they have that in stock too. You might be wondering what a guest bedroom looks like and I can show you just a sneak peek at one of the rooms. This one doesn't have ensuite bathroom but some do and there was a bathroom very near. There's also a guest laundry as well so if you need to do some washing there you can do that. Before we head to dinner, and I'll show you the dining room then, let's just head outside again and have a look at the Beacon Youth Centre where I used to work. And that's an outdoor activity centre. And school groups come there often and have activity weeks and weekends there. As well as church groups and there's things like dads and lads weekends take place here as well. Okay, it's time for dinner. Let's go to the dining room. I'll have a look at the dining room while it's empty, first of all, and then I'll show you what we had for dinner. Dinner with fish and chips and lovely ice cream for the dessert. Uh, I've had such a lovely day here at the Abbey. It's been really lovely to spend the day here as a guest again and to meet up with my friend who I was on community with and just to enjoy the atmosphere of being with lots of people and just in this beautiful, peaceful place and seeing the wonderful scenery again. It's been absolutely amazing. 
hope you've enjoyed this little look around the house and grounds and until the next video i'll say goodbye i'm going to link to a video about the history of lee abbey and the valley of rocks so i hope you enjoyed that if you want to watch that one thanks so much for watching i'll see you in the next video bye for now